go. Hello everyone, my name is Father Matthew Mason. I'm the Vocations Director for the Diocese of Manchester, New Hampshire. And you know, when I became Vocations Director last year, uh, it was a bit overwhelming. I realized very quickly that this was the job of promoting vocations is a job that's much bigger than any one person can do. Uh, I can't be at the 90 parishes and 20 Catholic schools in our diocese all at once. Uh, even though we're a fairly small diocese, certainly compared to Houston. But uh, what I quickly realized is that the church could be in all those places at once, and that if we could get priests and deacons and lay people on board with the work of promoting a culture of vocations across the diocese, that uh, we could all together uh, really create a real change here in our diocese. And so when I read uh, Rhonda's book, Hundredfold, I quickly realized I needed to get he her here to really jumpstart this effort. And she came in this past year to speak both to our deacons and priests at their annual workshop, as well as doing a follow-up workshop for lay people. And because it worked that way, because she got the priests and deacons on board first, she was then, we were then able to get about 70% of our parishes represented at the lay workshop as well. And Rhonda did a wonderful, wonderful job talking about the importance of promoting vocations at the local level. And people were so excited coming out of the workshop. And now I have this whole army of people around the state who are actively promoting vocations in their local parishes and schools. They're praying for vocations. They're sustaining the effort that efforts that we make for vocations. And they are speaking to our youth. And all the time now, when I go around to different parishes, I keep hearing about the vocation ministries that have started and the work that they're doing. I have uh, recently on the um, World Day of Prayer for Vocations, I was at one of our local parishes and uh, they didn't know I was coming, but they had planned this entire day uh, after masses with cutouts of priests and nuns and information about vocations. And they were inviting people to our vocation camps and they were so excited handing out prayer cards. Uh, and then I showed up as the vocations director and it all worked out great. So uh, thank you to Rhonda for all that she did to help us create a culture of vocations here in New Hampshire. It's certainly working. Uh, and um, whatever you can do to support Rhonda and her efforts, to keep praying for her, to financially support her, would be a great, great help because she's doing this now across the country in many, many dioceses, large and small. Thank you.